Hi everyone, I am joined by Sarb and Mandeep Hans from Hans Dairy, and they have an inspirational story to share today. And if you haven't tried their South Asian inspired dairy products, you are in for a real treat. So happy to have you guys here today. Thank you. Can you tell us a little bit of the story about how Hans began, how Hans Dairy began? Uh, my parents emigrated here in the 70s and at that point, they couldn't find what they were looking for, so they were making it all at home. Yes. And then when they reached their 60s, they were like, you know what, let's do something. So they started the dairy in their 60s. In their 60s. In their 60s, and they decided they were going to make authentic South Asian products. Amazing. Yeah. So your parents started the business, so how did you two become part of the business? So when my parents were in their 70s, at that point, I think they were ready to slow down and just enjoy a life. So they wanted to see if one of us wanted to take it over. So they called Sarb up and she was working in New York as an investment banker at the time. I know. Completely different from the food <laughs> field and said, hey, do you want to try take this over? And Sarb jumped at the chance. Um, kind of frightening at that time because it was really just a, a bricks and mortar operation. Mm -hmm. The building was set up. They did all the proper legwork, the hard work, I should say, where all the machinery was set up and so it was set up in a really great way but Sarb is the one that brought it up to fruition and brought it up to what it's like right now so she jumped on the chance and worked with them for about two years is that fair two to say? years thank you but two yeah. years yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then how did you get involved in the business yeah so um Sarb was working in for the working in the company for quite a while and she called me up and said hey you know what we are growing we're expanding mm -hmm. I need help mm -hmm. pretty much and is this something that you would entertain doing and so I took some time off from my other job and worked with her for a few weeks and thought you know what I could contribute in a way that would be beneficial to the company and also great for me so I've been working with her for quite a while now on the uh, marketing and sales side of the business. Excellent. It's so nice to keep it in the family. You know, it really, it really would have been a shame. Your parents made this business with love, you know, because they wanted to have the best products. They couldn't find them. And, and to see that go somewhere else, it would be, you know, hard probably. So it's great that you guys have taken over Thank you. and carrying on with your parents' traditions. I know that the quality is so important to Hans Dairy. Can you tell us a little bit about what sets Hans Dairy apart in that sense? Well, so when we started making products for the South Asian market, they were very proficient in making those products themselves. Mm -hmm. They were great at making their yogurts, their cheeses, and everything else they wanted. So we needed to make something that was authentic. It had to be with natural ingredients, wholesome ingredients, because that's the only way that they would replace what they were making at home. So we stick to that. So everything that we make has five or less wholesome ingredients, and most of them you can find in your kitchen. So that is the, our selling proposition. The other thing we do very much is that we make sure that we spend all our money within Canada. So we make sure that we buy 98% of all ingredients, inputs and stuff in Canada, because that's the community that supports us. And so we want to make sure that we um, I love give hearing that back. That. That's amazing. Thank that's you. so great to hear. It's so nice to know that everything's local and, and you know that you're not cutting corners and that even though you know it may cost you more in production, you know it's good stuff. And you know, we, that's what we want to eat, right? So yep, it's very so much so. I think our tagline is that if we don't feed it to our families, we will not make it at the dairy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can you tell us a little bit about the products? Like what kind of things do you have? I've, I've, I know about the rice pudding and, <laughs> you know, all the yummy things, but um, what, what types of products do you have just so that everybody knows about them and, and how can they be used in our cooking and um, you know, I know you have some really good recipes. Oh, too, absolutely. So. <laughs> yeah, we have um, a line of yogurts that we make for the South Asian community. And we also uh, have started a lactose free yogurt as well. Mm -hmm. And uh, we make uh, smoothies and which are a great addition to your kids lunchbox, even as an after school snack. Some of the cool recipes that we've come up with is using our smoothies as um, popsicles. So freezing the smoothie, throwing it in any berries that you want. And it makes a great snack for the kids. Yum. Yeah. Yeah. And then great. you mentioned rice puddings. So yes. <laughs> we've come up with some really interesting, innovative ways to make snacks for your kids. So one example that we have is baking tarts and filling them up with rice pudding and throwing whatever your kids like, like whether it's bananas, berries, anything like that. Uh, we also have come up with um, interesting things like a rice pudding tiramisu cake, something that honestly I hadn't heard of before. And we came up with that. And we have a line of um, uh, smoothie drinks as well, or lusty drinks that are yogurt based. And they're sweet and they're also savory options for anybody that oh, is interested in that. Yeah, that's we have a different. unique one that's salty and spicy. So not everybody likes it, but it's great for marination for your chicken, <laughs> oh, for the barbecue time. Yeah, that sounds amazing. So there's so many different ways you can use it. It's not just necessarily eating yogurt, you know, by itself, right? There's so many different ways. 
So I've been looking at some of the recipes and everything just looks so delicious. And I need you to tell me about the butter because it's not called butter. No, it's makkan. So makkan is the Indian name for whipped butter. So it's a whipped butter that's spreadable. When you get it out of the fridge, you can put it on your toast. You can cook with it. We also have a lot of savory and sweet recipes. One is where we use strawberries and we put it in the butter with strawberry jam and it becomes a spread on your muffin. So it's a very versatile product and very delicious. So if anyone's watching, how can we find out more about Hans Dairy and uh, learn about your products and your recipes? Where do we go? We have a great website. It's hansdairy.com. You can come there and we have tons of recipes and tons of information on our products. We also do a lot of stuff on social media. Yes. So on Facebook or on Instagram and we do contests there. We run like different types of things there that engage everybody and get them to understand our products more. Yes, I love it. So great. So we, we can win things if we check them out on social media and go to the website. And I've seen some of your posts on social. They're so fun. I mean, I've seen you guys dancing and just like having a great time. And the recipes are gorgeous. They just, everything looks so yummy. I just uh, can't wait to try everything. And I thank you both so very much for coming and sharing your family story. It's really, really cool to hear that. And it's, I just love knowing all of these things about Hans Dairy as far as your family, the traditions, the, you know, the, the quality of the, of the ingredients and the Canadian-ness of it too. I just love. So I thank you so very much. I can't wait to go to check out the website. So make sure you do too. And thank you again so very much for coming here and, and sharing your story with us. Thank you so much thank for you having so us. It's just lovely to get to know you both. You as well. Thank Same. you.